Hey everyone, so this is how I make my hair bows. I take a 6 by 8 inch piece of fabric, I fold it in half lengthwise, I stitch along and use my scissors to cut the edging, then I turn it inside out to make the rectangle and I find the place where I would like the front of the bow to be. So I want Mickey right at the front and I centered it, fold it in half and then stitch across, and then once I've stitched it, use my shearing scissors again and turn it inside out and I have this um, bow rectangle. Now I do the center, I take a two inch by six inch piece of fabric, fold it in half, sew it lengthwise, and once I've done that, I turn it inside out using a safety pin to turn it inside out, just push it through. And I usually use about a two inch piece of fabric for the center. So in order to find out the best way is not just to squeeze it, but to fold it sort of in a zigzag kind of way. And then you can put your center fabric over it and you can find how much you need. So I always leave a little bit and then I have enough room. Now you don't want to do it too tight because it could damage the center, so, but um, that looks about right. So once I've done that, I can push my bow through the center loop and you can see I've stitched it really tightly. And like I said, don't make it too small. You want a little bit of a wiggle room. So here's where the ironing comes in. I always iron the center, sort of in a zigzag pattern like so, so that the center of the bow is always perfectly creased. And it's, it takes a little time and patience, but just the center and always, always just iron the back of the bow, never the front, because the iron can sometimes take some of the colors away from the bow and Mickey would come out really sort of a dull grayish, not this bright black. So I pull it through, put an alligator clip through the back, and there is the perfect bow. Thank you. Please like and subscribe.